Hi, I'm Dr. Jamie Reynolds. And I'm Dr. Andrea Dapp with Spillane and Reynolds Orthodontics. Many people mistakenly think orthodontics is only about straightening your teeth, but it's also about correcting your bite. In fact, most likely more importantly than straightening your teeth, the impact of your bite on the health of your teeth and jaws for the rest of your life is super important. Are there ways that you can tell that your bite may be off? I'm gonna give you five easy things that if you're having these problems, you should have your bite evaluated. The first one is tooth pain. If you've ever had a filling or a crown done and that crown is off by just the fractions of a millimeter, you can immediately start to have significant pain in your tooth. So if you feel like your bite has changed even the smallest amount and all of a sudden you're having spontaneous pain in one of your teeth, you need to get your bite checked out. Another sign that your bite might not fit together correctly is TMJ pain. Now your jaw joint is composed of two bones, both your lower jaw and where it attaches to your skull. The two are separated by a thin disc which is meant to kind of cushion the two. If you start to notice any clicking or popping, or you get persistent headaches that just won't seem to go away, be sure to talk to your orthodontist to see if your bite could be a contributing factor to your TMJ pain. The third thing is muscular pain. Muscles are responsible for movement of your jaw. If your bite's not right, those muscles can start to flinch, and over time, overactivity of those muscles can create pain, most commonly across your temples and your brow, which can also manifest as migraines, by the way, and down in the muscles that control your lower jaw called the masseter. If you're feeling like you have tension headaches, especially early in the morning, or if you have migraines that really haven't been able to be solved by medication or anything that you've tried, very good chances you could be having muscular issues related to your bite. The fourth sign that your bite might not fit together properly is tooth wear. If you have excess amount of overbite, meaning that your top teeth overlap your bottom teeth too much, then your teeth may be beating each other up a bit. If you start to notice that your bottom teeth are crowding, that may be because your teeth aren't fitting together properly and they're starting to wear each other down. Lastly, is gum problems in gum wear. If you start to have recession of your gums, notching of your teeth down around your gum line, a dentist telling you they're brushing your teeth too hard, small micro traumas over time by your bite not fitting together well can create issues with your gum which ultimately lead to recession. If you notice any of these problems in your teeth, bite, or jaws, please contact your local orthodontist and have your bite evaluated.